My name is Derek Jenkins. I'm the director of design of Mazda North America, and we're here at our design center in Irvine, California. Today I'm going to walk you through a little bit about what we do with the SEMA Show program here at Mazda. Every year we do a series of custom products just for the show, so we're going to talk about the importance of that and take a look at the creative process. So let's go around back and take a look at some of the designer's work. We try to focus on our new products, whatever we have coming to market that's a fresh product. So this year we'll be doing uh, two custom Mazda 3s, one hatchback and one sedan, and then we're going to take two Mazda 6s and do a custom treatment on both of those cars. The reason Mazda attends SEMA is really about the position of our brand and the importance of our brand, uh, both from a, a kind of dynamic, sporty, youthful product and from the standpoint of being relevant in the marketplace. We use that opportunity to take our current products and show them in a way that people might not normally see them on a road. So we'll attend SEMA just to see some of those new trends coming up from the street. And that has a huge influence on us as we go back to the studio to start thinking about products um, two, three, four, five years in the future. Those ideas are already influencing us. You know, we try to focus on um, enhancing the car's key attributes. If the car already looks low and sleek, we want to make it look lower and sleeker and even more emotional. So we'll go through and we'll strip down the car, strip off the wheels, brakes, suspension, and we'll usually go out and have either custom suspension developed, custom brakes developed, so the car is already kind of sport tuned either for the street or even for track use. We'll also look at the engine, exhaust, uh, other elements of performance that we can enhance on the vehicle. Then we'll go through and start to really determine what, what kind of color palette do we want to do on the exterior of the car with respect to paint or graphics. And that's going to hopefully enhance the appearance, make it more visually striking, and, and get some attention at that show. And then lastly, we're coming in and looking at the interior of the car. We'll literally strip down the entire interior of the car. All the upholstery comes out. We'll do custom leather work, custom stitching. We'll redo the accents on the interior. By the time we're done, um, the car is in a million pieces all over the floor. <laughs> parts are in the paint booth, parts are over in this room, parts are out of the vendors, and it all has to kind of come together at the very end. Usually it's a big success at the show, so hopefully that's the case again this year.